My name is Carol Setien, and I am the director of the Pan American Health Organization. I am speaking to you from my home because we are under stay at home orders to stop the spread of COVID-19. If your city or locality is under similar orders, I urge you to do your part to comply fully and help save lives. Each year, World Health Day is observed on the 7th of April in commemoration of the founding of the World Health Organization. The theme for World Health Day 2020 is nurses and midwives leading the way to universal health with the campaign slogan being invest, value, trust, respect. This year, we highlight the vital role being played by nurses and midwives in providing care around the world. And within the context of the current COVID-19 pandemic, I wish to take this opportunity to convey our heartfelt appreciation to all our nurses and healthcare teams on the front line of health services and in the fight against COVID-19. Three months ago, the World Health Organization was alerted to an outbreak of acute respiratory syndrome, since designated as COVID-19. In this short period, the coronavirus has spread to almost every country in the world. There is a real risk now that our health systems will become overwhelmed if mitigating action is not taken and with firm resolve. Additionally, there is a real risk that the most vulnerable people will be disproportionately impacted by this pandemic. Social distancing, mass testing, and contact tracing, when combined with respiratory etiquette, hand washing, infection prevention and control, and other strategies have been shown to be highly effective in reducing the impact of this virus. In many affected countries, actions have been taken to surge the capacity of our health services. Equity and solidarity must guide our decisions based on a clear vision of universal health, leaving no one behind, even in these times of emergency. COVID-19 is demonstrating that effective mitigating actions are possible when our health systems are resilient and underpinned by the continued commitment and dedication of our frontline healthcare workers. They are our greatest asset in maintaining the health and security of our populations. By standing in solidarity with them, and providing the moral, technical, and logistical support and resources that they need, we can overcome COVID-19 in the Americas. We must protect them as they work so they can protect us as well. We must invest, value, trust, and respect the work that they do during and beyond this public health emergency. This year's World Health Day is observed in recognition of the Year of the Nurse and Midwife. In the midst of what should be a celebration of nursing, we acknowledge the enormous contribution of our nurses today in taking care of hundreds and thousands of people across the Americas. We have heard tragic stories of the nurses, doctors, and other health professionals who have made the ultimate sacrifice in carrying out their duties in this pandemic. Despite this, the spirit of service and selflessness endures as our health workers continue to care for patients regardless of the personal risks. Their courage, dedication, care and compassion is being celebrated around the world by whole populations who are applauding them daily. I want to urge all of us to continue in this spirit, 
to work with our dedicated nurses and health workers during these trying times and to continue to extend to them our fullest cooperation, our unstinting support, and our boundless gratitude for their vital service. Thank you all. Please keep safe and be well.